You even get, uh, there's a trophy at stake, I understand. There is. Where's the trophy? Is this like a run of the mill trophy? trophy that you get or what from, is you this know? Something cool? Bring whatever, it in. Jason. Wow. Oh, now that. <laughs> Which we'll just take home with us today. Yeah, that's, well, <laughs> that's interesting. You all at home can think what you will about that trophy. I guess you could say if you get the trophy, you're the wiener. <laughs> That's very impressive. Okay, what else are you putting on top of your toast here? They said you could remove the trophy to be in my ear, but I don't want to touch it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You could just leave it there. It's fine. Yeah, well, yeah whatever. Um, good luck. In a weird way, I hope you win and hope you don't win the trophy. Yeah, you right? Know, right? <laughs> Make a necklace Where do you put out it? of it. Do you mount it? I don't know what you do. <laughs> Please don't say that. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Sharon and Lee. Good morning, everyone. Yeah, so I'm inside Jeff's Catering Banquet and Events Center in Brewer, where in about 10 minutes, a couple hundred people are expected to start showing up for this special breakfast. Right? Yeah, there we go. Not as humid today, but overall, <laughs> hi, Bree! <laughs> One bizarre Instagram account has hatched a plan, an egg plans to break the record for most likes on a popular photo sharing app. She is laughing. <laughs> but she said egg as an E-G-G. -G. <laughs> but now an excellent account called World Record Egg is going to whisk it and take on the challenge. Did you see that egg excellent? I love that. <laughs> there is no egg nori. This egg that currently has more than 2.1 million likes so far. So not... Exactly. You're, you are the only person loving the puns. <laughs> this is so funny. But it's so it is 7.40 on a Thursday morning. Let me take a look at our conditions house. It is a beautiful start this morning, and we have a nice summer day on the way. Melissa, please help me. <laughs> Well, we'll take take you to the roads this morning. So, Everard, if you know of anyone having a baby shower, there you go. Well, it's funny that you mentioned that because I am very happy to announce that my wife and I have a lot of baby gifts that we got to buy for some friends that you know are expecting. So, looking forward to that. We we'll buy them all at Walmart. <laughs> you should have seen Roger's face. <laughs> Oh, man. All right, Maribel, thank you for that. <laughs> wow. We're, we're not. Wow. Just, just I to be was clear. like, oh, just my to be clear. gosh. <laughs> no buns in that oven. Yeah. Oh, it's Big Red. I'm so excited. Big Red. Oh. Oh. oh you crack story. yourself up, don't you? Yeah. I'm really new here, guys. So, hey, all right, let's go <laughs> check out the numbers for you. <laughs> Anyway, we, all right, let's go ahead. Dude, this is the high temperatures during the day yesterday. <laughs> 61 degrees there, 64, going 65. Yeah, I got around Terre Haute. All right, let's show you. <laughs> Look at Drew. All right, we are, we're laughing during the commercial break. We all hit, hit our, our funny bone here. And I have tears in my eyes coming down. All right, rain is back out across Illinois, and it is coming in across parts of Indiana. Here's a day does go by. <laughs> You know what's so funny, Drew? I have to leave, Randy, because we're we're egging each other on at this point. Fifty-seven degrees by four o'clock. Oh, he's got. We're just trying to do live TV. That's that's what happened with on Saturday. It's Sunday, eighty-four degrees. Eighty-four degrees on Saturday. Eighty-three degrees during the day on Sunday. 